So today I want to talk to you about something that completely changed the way that I train. It's something called muscle contraction, which you may have heard of before, but I often see it done incorrectly and inefficiently all the time. The reason it's important is because by getting 100% muscle contraction, you're activating every single fiber in the muscle, which means you're gonna improve the way it looks, it's gonna grow, but also it's gonna be working more efficiently, it's gonna be stronger. There's one exercise in particular that I've seen done really ineffectively and inefficiently all the time, and that's a plank. You often see people holding planks for seven minutes. I mean, I personally couldn't think of anything more boring, but there you go. I often hold a plank for about 30 seconds. And if you're getting 100% muscle contraction, that's all it needs to be. Okay, let me show you a plank, how I see it done inefficiently all the time. Okay, so there's nothing wrong with this in principle, okay, as long as the back isn't sagging or anything like this. But right here, I'm not really feeling it anywhere. Um, I'm feeling my arms a bit, and I'm not feeling it in my abdominal region, which is where I want to feel it. And most of the stress is on my joints, not on my muscles. Okay, so I'm gonna show you right now what I mean by contraction. So I'm gonna contract my abs as hard as I can right now. <sighs> okay, it's a lot harder. So by driving my elbows down, tilting my hips and tensing my abs as hard as I can. That's what I mean by contracting, tensing. I'm getting 100% contraction on those abs and I'm feeling it a lot more. So let me show you the difference one more time just so you can see it. This is me not contracting, just kind of relaxing, not feeling it in my abdominal region, which is why I'm doing a plank. And this is me contracting. <laughs> okay, so I'm driving elbows back, I'm tilting my hips, I'm squeezing my glutes and I'm tensing my abs as hard as I can. Okay, so this is one of the most common exercises that I've seen, I see done inefficiently. It applies to lots of different exercises. If you're doing a squat, you squeeze your glutes as hard as you can. It just comes down to that mind-body connection again. All right, so I talk about this quite a lot. But once you bring 100% attention to the muscles being used, you tense those muscles as hard as you can in an exercise, that's when your strength, your physique, your fitness levels are gonna completely transform. If you understand that the nervous system controls your muscles, and initially there might be a problem with the communication between the nervous system and your muscles, but the more that you do this, the more you'll train the nervous system to stimulate those muscle fibers, and then you'll really start to feel the burn and you'll get that 100% contraction. Don't worry if this doesn't make much sense to you initially, but in your next workout, in your next gym session, think about that 100% contraction. Rather than bouncing up and down in a squat, use control, squeeze your glutes. Next time you're doing a plank, drive those elbows back, tense your abs as hard as I can. Just as if someone's gonna come and give you a punch in the stomach, it has that same feeling of tensing those abs. The more that you do this, the more efficient your nervous system becomes at activating those muscle fibers, and that's when everything changes. Mm -hmm.